finally deciding that Andre Ware would be their man, and Andre Ware gives the ball to Dave Denal, and Denal stumbles his way up close to the 40-yard line. Now, in the last series, when they came off the field, Ware had some things to say to Denal, probably about the pass he threw in his direction that was intercepted, but also, I think, about some of the blocking assignments. Well, he was expecting to run that pattern out, and Denal looked like he may have given up on it, and sometimes players do that when they feel they don't have a chance to just give up on the route, and Andre Ware felt that, hey, run it out. You cost me and the team an interception. Anthony Drawhorn has made both picks so far for Birmingham. A passing situation. This time the pass is complete to Dave Denal, and he has a first down as he crosses midfield into Birmingham territory at the 54, an 18-yard gain. And more often than not, when you see those type of confrontations between two players on offense, they'll have a tendency to come back. But watch the arm strength of Andre Ware. He puts that ball on a rope. He gets the ball out to Denal where he can get turned around and get headed up the field. Nice play for the Ottawa Rough Riders offense. Ball is at the 53, first and 10 for Ottawa. Odessa Turner lined up wide to the left. Ware looked over the middle, couldn't find a receiver, decides to run with the ball and loses it as he goes down, but the whistle had already gone in the vicinity of the 47-yard line. That's a pickup of six. Steve Henley came up to make the tackle with help from Sam Peoples, who was only with the Barracudas for his second game after coming out of the camp of the San Francisco 49ers. Well, Andre Ware goes back into the pocket. He was getting some time. He felt the heat coming, and he tucked the ball, stepped up, but watch the hit from Sam Peoples right at the end of this run right that that's where the officials have to step up and protect the quarterback because he was down he wasn't going any further and he came in with the top of the helmet that's spearing second and four ottawa handoff inside to dave denal and he will be close to a first down as he continued to drive towards the vicinity of the 42 yard line before before being stopped by steve anderson or well, running behind Mike Shad and James Moreau right in the middle of that offensive line. They're very pleased to have Mike Shad in their offensive lineup. Almost a mishap on the running game. But look at the drive blocking of Mike Shad right there in the center of your screen. They feel that he's one of the better offensive linemen in the CFL just in his second game here with Ottawa. First and 10. Screen pass, Dave Denal, and it is broken up by Mike James. Couldn't get the blocking set up in front of Denal before James came through to make the tackle. Well, D uh, Denal got tied up with David Black, his offensive guard, who was trying to get out and get a block for him. He got tied in with James and wouldn't get disengaged, and he got caught for the loss on the play. He talked about Mike Shad earlier. The coaching staff was saying that he does...